Hello, I'm back again. We've now got some boxes and we're going to do probably the, my favourite part of this sort of work. Um, this is where we go through things. I suppose if you watch the gold mining shows, uh, they refer to a thing called pay dirt, and this is my version of pay dirt. Um, basically, it's boxes that we put away in the units. Sometimes I know what's in there. The, this bunch, I don't know what's in there. So what we do now is uh, we take the stuff out of the box, we have a look at it, and let's see if we can make some money. So let's start with this box. Now, first thing out, we get loads and loads and loads and loads of this sort of stuff. Um, I do keep it. <coughs> um, we have a roadside stall, if you like, and if anybody knows the Mosley area, um, Graham at the Mosley Dance Centre, on a Wednesdays, we have a stall there where we sell tools, and this is the sort of stuff that we sell all day long. It's not, not much money, a couple of quid, that's all. Okay, I don't like China. Right, this is Royal Daughter, Scarlet. Uh, we'll just unbox, I think we've got a lot of jewellery coming out. Okay, this is a swab. It would be for a, like an interior designer would have used this for uh, going through stuff with clients. I don't think it's worth anything. If it said William Morris on the front of it, maybe, but no, on this, nothing. So that goes in the rubbish. Right, always nice to unpack paper. So let's have a look at the dates on this. Always nice to know the last time this seen there. Oh wow, okay. Oh, Susie Cooper. Uh, this is a uh, Art Deco. Uh, Seems at the sign. Uh, yeah. Uh, definitely worth a second glance at. So what we're going to do is put this to one side. And the last time that this was out in the fresh air, let's have a look at the uh, date, February 1992. And I didn't see that, probably not. So, yeah, Monday, February the 3rd, 1992. So, what we've seen earlier is about 25, 30 years. Let's have a look. We've got more newspapers coming out. Oh, again, okay. this is all Susie Cooper stuff. I don't, as I say, I don't know about ceramics, but I do know a little bit about it. Okay. Oh, okay. Guinness gift set. Uh, anything with the Guinness brand on is generally worth a second look, so I'll put that into the second look pile. Not sure on that. Okay, glasses, glasses, glasses. Uh, not sure. Glasses I find very limited marketplaces. Possible, that's a sherry glass. I don't think it's cut. I'm looking for a, oh, I don't know. I don't know enough about glass. So, and another one. No. Oh. How much fun am I going to have on opening this?
little cut glass one. No. Again, I, I, not my favourites. This really isn't. Again, a small little wine glass. Don't know whether it's wine, pool, probably. And again, from the same. We've got three of them now. Four. Five, but a different design, so that's exciting. That's a pools. That's a that's an old one. That's well, it's obviously from the nineties. So, but over to one side. Uh, Millennium flutes. Hmm. Don't know what to make of that. I can see a lot of this going to uh, Graham, who's a friend of ours. Uh, again, another Royal Dalton Scala piece. That's the uh, milk jug. More little glasses. Another little design. Same design, just different shaped glass. And again, more glasses. I'm going to get overwhelmed. Tissue. And again, same sort of design. Let's have a look again. Do you reckon it's a glass? I do. There it is. Alright, another layer of paper. Oh, wow. Alright, I think we've got lucky with it. So mainly this, this box is going to be mainly glassware, though. I just found. So it's. Some of these tools, these little things, can be worth quite a bit of money. So I'm going to have a second look at that. And again, I do like tools. Regular glass tumblers. I think then these are just going to go straight out. That's sort of cute. I do like things like that. Angel Delight dishes, as I call them. That's how I used to have my Angel Delight served up. So, uh, put that one to one side because I like it. And again, another little, that, that, that would be a fruit dessert uh, bowl, you know, fruit salad and stuff like that. Oh, I don't know the age of that. I suppose an interesting glass. But we have got a lot of glassware now. Let's just see. I'll just pull some bits out. Uh, things like that. Now, not seeing any particular value here at the moment. Uh, the Susie Cooper stuff currently, but again, not clear. No glass, glass dish. Probably heard the cheek of the glass. We're going to pull loads and loads of glass out. But you never know, always keep going with these sort of things because there's always a surprise. That's my experience. Or is that my hope? Hope, mainly. So many of these. What, what I will do after I've opened them all, 
I'll sort these all out into different sets and uh, we'll see I'll grade them basically to what I think is I'm going to be honest current market conditions what we found glassware is not good so I'm going to guess unless anything really stands out to me that that's interesting it is definitely cut the weight on it's nice so if that that might be my find that might be but i'm not expecting big money on that so i've got the second one so if, if i can find four of them that might be something that's worth a look at And then wine goblets, blue glass, I might do a bit of research on it just because the way it could possibly I don't know. I don't know. Right. Again, that's cut glass. It's just the weight on it. I uh, don't know whether that really. Any comments? I'm running out of room. Another blue one. Another blue one. Another blue one. I think if we get to set to six, it's always uh but on five on the blue glass ones. The other thing I don't really like about the glassware is posting it out, to be honest with you. Uh, limited success. I think if you've got the original packaging, it can, tends to work best. Oh, oh hello, 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 hello. Ha. Tudor, England. It's got a bit of white to it. I think it's oh, it's this is this is definitely a boozer's uh, pub. It has the uh, I don't know whether you can see that, but that's the crown, and that gives you the uh, tells you that that weighs that takes a point. And it goes. We continue onwards. From my first box, this wasn't uh, the most fascinating one, I'll be honest. Uh, but this is the reality of what we do. Um, this is the sort of stuff, it comes to us in waves, this does. At the moment, we're getting a lot of it purely because um, there's no market for it, or there's very little market for it, unless it's something really special. Uh, I'm not seeing anything super special here, so... And as I say, um, I, I, I like that, but I don't know what to do with it. I don't even know whether it's a drink or a vase, that one. But again, ah, we may have a set of glass ones on here. There's a quarter of a point. You see, what I'm doing now, really, after uh, after I've unboxed everything, I'll sort this all out into sets. Uh, I'll probably spend far too much time on this, but as I say, normally, this is what we, the reality of the work we do, I guess. It's 
not all Rembrandts and no boring. I want to be excited by something. I think I might have about 12 of these now. Here we go again. You know what I'm liking? I don't know why. I'm going to have to check them. Oh dear, breakage. And this is the problem. This is why I really don't like uh, that. Here are a bit of breakage at the bottoms. I haven't found any broken thing yet. Bound to be something I like. Always is. The contract. Oh, yes, of course it was. And one of the nice smokes that it is broke. Oh, dear. So that can be thrown away. And then it comes to the end. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm going to say that that is Cobra beer. And I reckon that's very early. I think that's first time out. We'll do some research on that. I actually like that. I might keep it. That's uh, a little. Let's have uh, one or two cute named stuff. Uh, I might be able to tell a few quid on that. And we're getting this chewed the glass. Shark would just broke one well, though, that's it, that's the only thing. And then again. And we really are coming to the bottom of the uh, thing. Yeah, we really are. I'm just, you see, I'm in the Cobra glass, made it worthwhile opening all these things up. Just caught my attention. Oh, I've got a pair of them. Oh, yeah, beauty. So, I like them. And I think that's early. I do. I don't know why. Indian, I've never seen that glass. And this is why you should really go through all your boxes properly. You never know what you're going to find. Rubbish. Generally, <laughs> it's rubbish, by the way. Ooh. Another bit more rubbish. Yeah. Uh, rubbish. Breakage. Oh dear. Right, that is the last item. Uh, I don't think our first box was uh, actually it's pretty indicative of what we do. Um, we don't find everything every day. Uh, we don't, but some days we do. Uh, the thing I'm excited about is the Cobra glasses and the Susie Cooper plates. Uh, but I'll get back. I'm going to pack everything away, get rid of the rubbish, and I'll come back with some valuations, I guess, and see. let's see what we got out of that box. Okay.